In tonight's sports news, intriguing matchups in FA's Island Cup, Netball Association to review constitution and domestic cricket finals galore this weekend. We kick off tonight's sports news of football. The St. Lucia Football Association Inc. sponsored National Lotteries Island Cup continues with game week six of competition this coming weekend at the Fawasso playing field in Babano. On Saturday, 24th August 2019, Canaries comes up against Labria at 6 p.m., while at 8 p.m., home team Babano hosts Leclerc. On Sunday, 25th August, VF4 South plays Miku at 6 p.m., and at 8 p.m., Grosile clashes with De Rousseau. Following the completion of the fifth round of competition, the point standings are as follows. Group A is led by Canaries on 15 points, with Roseau Valley also on 15 points, with seven matches played. Miku sits in third place with 13 points, whilst Deriso rounds up the fourth place on 12 points. Meanwhile, in Group B, it is led by Central Castries and Marsha on 12 points. However, Central is on top by a goal difference. Then relies third with 11 points, and Mabia Valley in fourth position on 8 points. Netball news now. The St. Lucia National Netball Association, following a meeting with its affiliates and various stakeholders, is continuing with its efforts to strengthen capacity and deliver good governance. To this end, a task force of the Constitution Review Committee under the chairmanship of Ms. Karen Tobia has been charged with the responsibility of paving the way forward in streamlining the Constitution to meet the growing demands and changes of the sport. This is a very important exercise and as such, the committee would like to meet with all and sundry on a day and time convenient in an effort to solicit their views and entertain inputs. For further information on the matter, please feel free to contact Ms. Karen Tobia at telephone number 722-3683. In tennis news, Serena Williams will play Maria Sharapova in the first round of the US Open at Flushing Meadows in New York. Novak Djokovic begins his title defense against Spaniard Roberto Cabellas Baena, while 2018 women's champion Naomi Osaka plays Anna Blinkova of Russia. Elsewhere in the men's draw, Spain's Rafael Nadal will play Australian John Millman, while 20-time Grand Slam champion Roger Federer will face a qualifier. In the women's draw, 15-year-old Coco Goff, who beat Venus Williams on her way to reaching the fourth round at Wimbledon last month, will play Russia's Anastasia Potapova. Meanwhile, Wimbledon champion Simona Halep will take on a qualifier. We hit the deck now with women's cricket. The long-awaited final of the St. Lucia National Cricket Association Alicia John T20 Women's Competition will be played this coming Saturday at the Mendo Phillip Park from 2 p.m. Contesting the final will be defending champions South Cast Trees and Grosile. Miss Alicia John, a former cricket administrator, after whom the competition is named, is expected to meet both teams prior to the start of the match. Grosile will be led by West Indies and Women's Island left arm medium pacer Kiana Joseph, while South Cast Trees will be led by Winwood's youth team all rounder and captain Nerissa Crafton. Seen in cricket news, the Mindo Phillip Park will again be a buzz of excitement this coming Sunday when the South Castries Cricket Association stages the final of the National Lotteries Authority T20 competition from 2 p.m. Millet Cobras and Bexon Oval superstars will square off in the final, which is expected to be a battle of the big hitters. Bexon will be looking to the competition's leading runs scorer, Colinas Calendar, to continue his good form after having blasted a boundary filled 122 versus Crusaders in his last encounter. Millet's Johnson Charles will be hoping for a good performance as he prepares to head to camp with the Barbados Tridents ahead of the 2019 Hero CPL tournament. Representatives of the National Lotteries Authority are expected to be on hand to present awards to individuals who perform outstandingly during the competition. The South Castries Cricket Association will also be announcing plans for the upcoming Invitational T10 Smash-Up competition. Finally, to celebrate the return of the St. Lucia Zooks to CPL, Zooks will give fans an opportunity to win home game tickets at Roots and Soul this weekend at Pigeon Island. Come and take a selfie at the Zooks setup location, email your picture at the address provided and you can get a chance to win tickets to the biggest party in sport at the Darren Sami Cricket Ground. September 20th to the 27th. CPL Cricket, Cricket played louder. That's how we end tonight's sports news.